Good morning and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're back down the beach. We're squidding. So I've got my, got my rod, got my squid jig. This is where I'm fishing. How's this? Slight easterly, nice blue day, nice and cool. Crystal clear water. Hopefully it's a good morning. So we'll get this squid jig out. I'll run through what I'm using a bit later and um, let's get it in the water, get some dinner. Hopefully do a catch and cook. <clears throat> oh, it's gonna be good. Let's get it in there. We're on. Big squid. Big squid. <laughs> We're on. See you guys, that easy. for a big bastard. <laughs> oh, now we've got to get him out. Somehow. How's that, guys? Big squid. Big for this area, anyway. <laughs> yes. Boom. All right, guys, let's get another one. I'm excited. There we go. One squid in the bag. Beautiful. Now he's going to ink up. The water's going to turn black, but that's all right. Let's go get his family. Oh, we're on again. Oh, good one. We're on, guys. This feels like another big one. How's this? Middle of the day. <laughs> there it is, on top of the water. Oh yeah. Big one. Big squid. Another one. There you go, guys. Big squid. There's some monsters. All right, guys, we're on again. Doesn't feel as big, but still, it's still decent, I think. <laughs> this is awesome. Couldn't ask for a better day. Nice and cool, easterly, 
no swell, big squid. There we go. Check that out. What do you reckon, guys? Three squid within 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, you can't see them. How good's that? Sorry about the noise in the background. We've got a bit of a dog school going on over there. But it's not stopping the squid. <laughs> All right, let's get it back. Now, what you want to do is to let it sink to the floor or near the floor and then just give it a twitch twitch one in the slack and keep reeling keep reeling while you're doing this real slow twitch twitch you want to be working that jig three quarters of the way down in the water column because the squid will be um hanging around the rock, rocky bottom and the um, all the seagrass and seaweed it's good to be chilling through there so hopefully the squid jig goes above them bang oh we're on <laughs> as soon as it hit the water, we're on. Not very big. But we're eating well tonight. <laughs> yes yes there we go guys check out that little beast that's four squid within half an hour <laughs> alright let's get him in the bucket alright guys how's that four squid from that spot so that spot's gone a bit dead so we're just going to move down the rocks a little bit look for another rocky patch of ground with a bit of weed and hopefully it's more squid there so i see you looking at my haircut drunken nights um my neighbor decided to shave my head 200 dollars bet so if i keep his hair for a week 200 bucks Woo! <laughs> anyway let's keep fishing all right so what you want to look for when you're squidding you want obviously clear water high tide preferably and you want seaweed and broken ground out out in the water there squid love it so that's here you want the squid jig to be down near the bottom of the water about a quarter of the way up you're going to be working over that seaweed the squid should see it boom you're on all right let's get them in all right the fishing has officially shut down so i'm going to have two more casts i'm going to go over there i'm going to jump in the water See what we can find. Hopefully pick up an Oki or two. And um, yeah. Add that to the cook up. Oh, it's going to be good. All right, two more casts. One. Two. All right. Did we get nothing on here? We're going in. Water's crystal clear, there's fish everywhere. <sighs> yes. Alright, it's time. The water is bloody freezing cold. 
but we're going in. We need more dinner. The squid are off the chew. I'm on the chew. Well, I will be tonight. Let's hope we find something else. Let's get in the water. So my weapons of choice before I go in. I've got my hand spear. Got my snorkel and goggle. Flippy. And me. That's all we need. So let's get in the water. Hopefully we find something. I'm out of the water. That's another day done. We did pretty good today. Check this out. Five squid. And an Oki. Oh yeah. How good's that? <laughs> All right, well, let's get our squid and Oki home. Do a bit of a cook up tonight, so. Let's get on it. Let's go. Welcome back to the Adventure Kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking some beer battered squid rings and some chips and we're going to be trying out some sand crabs. Let's get to Aiden. All right, so we've got our squid. We've got five squid today and an Oki. So today we're cooking up three squid. Like Paddy said, we're doing beer battered uh, squid rings. I caught this little sand crab last night. We're going to be trying him out too. So can't say I've ever tasted one of them. So we'll give that a go. First thing we're going to do, we'll get this crab on the boil, clean their squid up, and then we'll show you what's next. All right, let's get this squid cleaned. So how do you clean a squid? Grab his head. Pull it off. Now they've got like a feather-like backbone just in here. You've got to get your finger in between the backbone and the, the meat, and work your finger up, taking out that backbone like this. Then you better grab that backbone. If it's not so slippery. And just pull it out. Like that. Then pull the guts out. Boom. Now next, the wings. You can slide your finger in between the wings and the body. Like so. Then you just wrap your finger in, work your finger in and under the skin. And the skin just peels off just like that. So we'll get all these done and we'll start cutting them up and make some batter. 
So you're in there all cleaned. All right, so the, the squid are all cleaned now. Now we're just gonna cut them into little circles, little squid rings. Then we'll make some batter. So you just want them nice and chunky. You wanna be able to taste the squid. We've got the wings, a few wings there. Big wings just cut in half. Couple wings, all the tentacles. They're my favorite part. And the rest of the tubes. Cut them into little squid rings. And we're nearly ready to go. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be good. So, for those of you that don't know who Patty is, he's my little nephew. He's, um, when he gets himself a GoPro, he's gonna start his own channel. So, look out for that. All right, squid's done. Let's start making the batter. All right, so the beer batter we're making today, you need plain flour, one cup. Or about one cup. Next, this is a nice easy one. Pepper. Got like a fair bit of pepper. Give it a bit of flavor. Next, garlic salt. Fair chunk of garlic salt. Well, garlic powder, not salt, sorry. Next, salt. About that much. I right, will just stir all this up, get those flavors in amongst the um, flour. Next, my favorite part, beer. So you just gotta add some beer in there and you want it like a thick paste. You don't want it too runny, you don't want it too dry. Making a bit of a mess, but that's all right. We're in the backyard, it's all good. So Paddy here, the most keenest fisherman you'll ever meet. What's your dream in life, Paddy? Um, big mulloway, big barramundi. Big mulloway and a big barramundi. Over a metre? Yeah. So you can bet your dad? Yeah. Yeah. I think that's everyone's goal. And the biggest marron ever. Biggest marron. Do you like eating marron? Yeah, I love it. Nice thick consistency like that. The water's boiling. We're going to chuck the crab in right now. And then we're going to re-boil again. And then um, after five minutes we're going to be eating the supper. Oh yeah. Now, I've just found out Patty's never ever eaten a crab before. So, how's it feel to not eat crab, Patty? Um, weird. Weird. <laughs> so, we're gonna cook this little sucker over here. And this is gonna be Patty's first ever crab. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm excited to try it. I'm gonna try the sand crab. Five minutes is up. Um, we're gonna take the crab out now, and then Hayden's gonna cook these squid rings. The oil is boiling, we're going to get the chips in there and then Hayden, after that Hayden's going to get the um, squid rings in. The chips are done, we're going to get them on the plate now, like so. Um, after that, Hayden's gonna get the squid into here. Alright, guys, Patty did a fantastic job cooking those chips. Now for the main part the squid. Beer battered squid. It's gonna be good. Alright, let's get these squids in. Squid head, tentacles. <laughs> My favourite part. Now 
it's a bit windy so it keeps cooling down the oil bloody annoying winter's definitely coming it's getting dark very quick all right we'll cook this bit first then we'll get the next bit in can't wait it's gonna be a good dinner How's this? Cooking squid in the backyard. Straight from the beach to the plate. Oh, way better than sitting in front of the TV or the computer, playing games all day. Get out there, catch some squid, cook them up, and have a mean feed. All right guys, this first lot's done. We'll get these ones out. Get the next batch in and then we're eating dinner we are done let's grab these out plate them up dig in paddy can test his crab out All right, guys, we're all done. How's this for a feed? Check that out. Beautiful. If you could smell that. <laughs> all right, let's dig in. What are we trying first? Um, crab? Yeah, let's go for the right, crab, we'll, guys. We'll go to sand crab first. So here's Patty's half. Here's mine. Give this a crawl. I've never tried this before either, so. <laughs> Wow. I've always chucked these things back, thinking they're shit. That is the most delicious thing I've ever tried. Patty said we're on to a winner. Definitely gonna keep these from now on. <laughs> wow. Awesome. All right, Patty, try your chips, mate. Patty's chips. Give them a go. Boom. Good. Huh. You can't beat fresh chips. Mmm. I feel it's amazing. Next part, squid. Dig in, Patty. What do you reckon, mate? You like it? Good. My favourite part. The head. Mmm. Oh yeah. <laughs> it just has a good flavour in the squid. <clears throat> Dig in, mate. Yep. Definitely under a winner. Well, guys. We're going to dig into this. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Hope you guys enjoyed it. As much as I like making it. I know Patty had a good time. Comment down below. <laughs> Comment down below for any sand crab recipes. Because from now on I'll be keeping sand crabs. Anyway. See you on the next adventure. See ya.